The Hempsville Rebels stunned a lot of people last season as they put together their best finish in school history. Now, head coach William Horrell has been there for the progression of the Rebels since he took over five years ago. I was able to catch up with the Red Hot Rebels as they enter week six, 3-0. Now in his fifth season as head coach of the Hempsville Rebels, William Horrell has seen the bad along with the good, coming off the best season in school history. But after having an 0-10 season in 2016, Harrell began to shift his focus and envision something special for his program. And then ultimately we wanted to make sure that we instilled lifelong values in them that we want to have reflected in our society. Uh, we won't always have the best athletes. We won't always have the best uh, situation. The ball won't always bounce in our favor. But what we want to make sure we do is we establish a consistent set of expectations and the mindset instilled by Harrell's first class has still not left the locker room as a standard has been set and the Rebels are currently 3-0. and As a team, we are a lot more conditioned than we were last year and we work more as a brotherhood, as a family. I mean, we had a good group of guys, but we still, they set the tone up for us and we set the tone for us as well and the young classmen that's here with us. And we're sitting there just bonding together, gelling together, make sure everybody is on one accord. Whether we're losing, whether we're up big, whether we're down big, whether it's tied, whatever the case may be, that's my expectation and it's the expectation I've had for the last two years now. And still not being taken serious after an amazing year, Hepsiba is simply using the talk from their naysayers as more motivation to keep them on track towards making a deep playoff run. Coach Bill is always telling us about a couple of our wins from last season were flukes and you know people saying we're overrated. So you know we just take all of that in and you know we eat it and we just want to go out there and show everybody what the real deal is when we play. And not just for a few seasons as helps but expects to remain as a hard-nosed football team right here in the CSRA for many years to come. So that regardless of whether it's me whether it's, you know, the players I currently have, whether it's the players I have 10 years from now, we want to make sure the biggest thing that's recognized is the brand, the brand of Hepsiba. 